probably more painful. I'm a little so, nervous for this. For those that watched last week's video and for those who haven't watched it, you're going to want to watch it because you get to watch me in pain. So last week we did the face mask, yeah. it's all natural. Unfortunately we used cinnamon, didn't realize cinnamon can burn your face. So my face turned a little purple and red, it was on fire for quite some time. But, but it got rid of my acne, so, so that was great. Exactly. There was kind of like, it worked but it didn't, I would say Definitely, if you guys wanted to try it, try it without the cinnamon. If yeah. you don't have sensitive skin though, I didn't have that bad of a reaction. It did yeah. cause my skin to blotch. Yeah. But other than that, it was fine. The next day I woke up and my skin was actually nice. So, so everyone likes to watch people in pain. So last week you got to watch me in pain. Now it's my turn to watch her in pain and the rest of you get to watch her in pain. We are going to do the waxes. I don't know how I feel about this. I'm so excited that she's actually trusting me to wax her face. I don't know. I'm yeah. I'm too <laughs> trusting. I feel like this is just too this trusting. I get my eyebrows done. I've gotten my mustache waxed one time, and it hurts so freaking bad. I've never done it any type of waxing in my life. So oh, I, it hurts. It's not fun. I don't know the pain, so I'm really nervous. But we figure you can kind of see me in pain yeah. and also do a product review because I know a lot of people do wax but don't want to spend the money. There's a Jolene one if you're too afraid to wax your skin or you have sensitive skin like myself. I can't use a lot of waxing products because a lot of them have a uh, chemical in it that can't be used on my skin. So I've actually used in the past a product called uh, Jolene. I don't think I've heard of that. And it work well? check. And it, it's not a waxing product, it's actually a bleaching product. So you put it on your skin and it bleaches the hair so it's oh. very it almost makes it finer this was 11.99 okay so and you get four fun. strips in it because i think because what we were doing it for i didn't need more than exactly two or one or two yeah. i don't know guys i'm really scared she's got a big upper lip so we need like all five of them <laughs> <Shut up. laughs> i don't i need to like i need to finish my wine before we do this this is scary i don't know we should have had a shot of whiskey for you Ugh. no thank you I've done a lot of, I have very high tolerance for pain, so Ugh, I have zero tolerance. I've pierced every part of my body that I've pierced or had pierced. I've done by myself. My nose ring, I'll explain that story another time. You did your nose ring? I did my nose myself. I did my belly button myself four times. That, you can paralyze yourself. I didn't know that. I was like 13 or 14. Oh I was a rebellious God. child. Christine, I did my, like, the oh. only one I did professionally was my cartilage because I know it's a little bit harder to get through all that cartilage, but yeah. everything else I did myself. And usually a shot of whiskey helped with the pain. So Ugh. we probably should have numbed you a little bit before, but I think it'll be fine. I think I'll be okay. We'll ready? see. I am ready. But before we get into that, I just wanted to point out yes these beautiful robes Christine picked up for us yeah. we had a couple comments of the robes that we were wearing last week which mine was from where was that? oh my robe from last week was from Target my so, robe was from Victoria's Secret we also got a lot of comments about the wine glasses which are from Crate and Barrel they are the Olivia Pope scandal wine glasses I've done them in a couple videos so just letting you guys know yeah. and then Christine Got these for us. Yeah, so I love La Vie en Rose, um, but I much prefer their outlet because I find you can get pretty much the exact same items at their outlet for 70 to 80 percent off. All right, are you ready? No. I'm I already really looked nervous. at the ingredients to make sure that my fingers can touch this. I probably should have read the directions, but I feel like I'm I know so what I'm doing. I don't know. Ooh, I see the wax. Me. What side do I put it on? I don't know. Maybe you should have read the instructions. <laughs> I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna. Okay. Wait, you don't wait, you don't even know which way to like rip it. Yeah, because your hair is going down that way, so I have to rip the opposite direction. It says, um, take out a strip and separate the two doubles, following the vertical pre-cut line. Yep, put on one side. Rub the double strip between your hands. Oh, you're supposed to rub it to make it warm. Oh shit. Here, just use one of these So you're supposed to rub it because you want to make it warm. Oops. Get that all ready to Oh yeah, it does warm up. It yeah. does. It's weird. Strip ya. And Sorry. I hope that doesn't offend you. I'm waxing it in front of people. I'm scared. I'm scared. I don't want to get through. Oh my god. This is rubbing the direction of the hair. Mm. I'm gonna rub it. I don't feel like it's hot enough though. Let me see. One, two, 
Christine's been tasered for fun. Yeah. I don't know this story. I just know what happened. <laughs> so stay tuned next week to hear those. And we'll come back at you with another product review. Yeah. Okay. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Bye, YouTube. Bye.